let us continue with our lesson and the next step uh, let us make use of the edit so whenever we click on this uh, edit floating button so we should open a edit layout so where we can edit the tax so for that let's go to the tax over here and what i will do is i'll create a new package inside this and call it as a edit and let's create a new i think we should create a fragment okay so fragment and we can just call it as a edit fragment edit tax i think that should be better and just click on finished so we have created a new fragment and uh, we need to add a layout first so let us get started with the layout so for edit layout i can just copy some of the things from our the add add tax so where was that add tax is somewhere here i think tax fragment i think it should be this one that we are looking yeah so this is the one that we want to make use and uh, what i will do is i will just go to the text view and i will copy the required i think most of the thing i think we required from here so i'll just copy all of this let, it, let me copy all of the view from here and let's go back and uh, what we will do is first of all let's change it to constraint layout we will not make use of frame load layout because the frame layout is only used for a single view so let's say a main layout and let's go to this section in a text view and uh, let me remove that one and close the constraint layout and inside this constraint layout let us add and just press alt and enter to import the app reference okay so i think that should be fine so if you check over here so we have a similar layout that we have in the add so title body and the the status of your tax so that should be better so i think we only need all of this and uh, we also need to have over here is the id so which id that you want to send for the update so i think that's all for this lesson we have created a view layout for our the edit tax and what is the issue over here let me check and let me try to fix it set focusable and i think let's do the same thing for over here i think we have the same issue so let me try to fix that one too and fix it okay so that should be fine and now we have our edit and whenever we click on the tax detail fragment edit button we should open the that layout so let's go to the navigation over here and uh, let us add the fragment that we just created over here and should be edit and this should be somewhere here and yeah so from the tax fragment we will be having a navigation to the edit tax okay so from here to here so that is the navigation graph that we have to create and for this one let us give a label name of let's say a edit edit tax i think that should be fine so we have added this one too and similarly i think we need to add the arguments that we have to pass from here we need to pass the all of the argument to our edit text so let's do it in the next lecture we'll pass all of our argument as well as the coding part that we need to do so let's meet up in the next lecture till then have a great day